Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Star Flames. Well, I guess Tom Brady has figured out that after being associated with a Kardashian, he needs to go somewhere like Africa to get rid of that Kardashian curse. And it seems as though that's exactly what he did for his 45th birthday. There was no signs of Miss Irina or any mentions whatsoever. So it seems as though he took that tribal trip where he could have gotten that tribal tri um, cleanse from the Kardashian curse. Let's talk about it. Now, they're saying that Tom Brady saying is focusing on being my best self after trip to Africa. Sounds like he got that African cleanse. But let's talk about what TMZ is reporting. So TMZ is saying Tom Brady is reflecting on the past 45 years after returning from his African safari vacation, saying the trip helped remind him life is all about relationships and memories. Tom Brady was in his fields following his getaway with the kids, releasing a heartfelt message on Instagram about the lasting, lasting impact his visit to the most amazing continent had on him. Tom Brady said, and I quote, to wake up to the sunrise and untouched parts of our beautiful planet, to witness, to witness these animals in all their glory, to see how different people can live with true joy and happiness continues to bring me great lessons in learning, end of quote. Now, listen, oftentimes we may joke about the Kardashian Jenner um, curse, the Kardashian curse, right? And some people may think that it's a joke, but there are times when, you know, some things happen to these men and you have to say, this shit ain't no joke. And if Tom Brady even had a one night stand with Kim, chances are he didn't want to take the chance of being hit by that curse. And as such, he went to his trip on out there to Africa, right? Now, Tom Brady had a little bit more to say than that. He said, and this is from quotes that he have included, that he had included on his Instagram. He said, the life you lead is a lesson you teach. No, I want you guys to pause for a second there because it was just a few days ago that Kim posted, practice what you post, right? Now, it may seem a bit far-fetched, but could she be talking about Tom Brady? But based on the time gap of the post, maybe not, right? But let's continue into what Tom Brady said. Tom Brady said, you know, after he said, the life you lead is the lesson you teach, he continued by saying, and if I am not for myself, who will be for me? If I am not for others, what am I? And added, he will continue to use the mantras as he embarks on the rest of his journey. He said that I am taking these next days one at a time, focusing on being my best self for me and others and living a life of integrity and purpose. That's what he said. But now, I believe that Tom Brady has been posting these quotes on his Instagram page. And I believe that people may not have been looking for Kim Kardashian to be clapping back at Tom Brady because oftentimes when you talk about Kim Kardashian clapping back at someone, it is normally her sisters, you know, or someone that Ye is dating or something along that line. So in this case, many of us might have missed something that Tom Brady said that triggered Kim for Kim to post 
practice what you post. Because, hey, if Ye came out and said Kim should go marry Tom Brady or someone, it definitely gave the sense that Tom Brady and Kim was dating. They had a little thing. It didn't work out because many people could have been warning Tom Brady to stay away from Kim because of the Kardashian curse. And he finally decided that it wasn't worth it. He was going to move on. And as such, Kim, you know, could be mad, saw one of his posts and clapped back with practice what you post, honey. And then Car and Tom Brady could have been there saying like, oh shit, the Kardashian curse is about to it. Let me head off to Africa, visit one of those tribes who were very good at you know healing and cleansing and get a ritual to get rid of that kardashian curse may sound far-fetched but it's not impossible and it's not even far-fetched at all but i want to hear from you guys let me know what are your thoughts and while you're at it give this video a big thumbs up share if you care and see you all next time. Bye, guys.